Today we are demonstrating pressure mapping of a test subject sitting on two different wheelchair cushions. One is a dynamic cushion and the other is a static cushion. Pressure mapping shows the interface pressure between the person and the cushion surface. The pressure mapping system we are using today is a calibrated FSA interface pressure mapping system. It is crucial that your system be properly calibrated or your findings will be inaccurate. Over the entire duration of this video, the pressure mapping system is running and capturing even the slightest change in the interface pressures that the cushions create on their own. On the left, we have the Softex seating system by Aquila Corporation, which is an automatic alternating cushion. This particular cushion was designed to offload the left ischial tuberosity full-time due to a current ulcer, while the remainder of the cushion is alternating. On the right, a commonly used static air flotation cushion. The static cushion is motionless. To understand the differences, the Softec cushion is a dynamic cushion. This means the cushion creates movement on its own. It automatically inflates and deflates two groups of internal air bladders to create movement without any help of the person on it. The movement, the alternation, is automatic and continuous while the system is being used. You can see the image on the left changing as the softtack cushion's automatic action takes place. A static cushion, on the other hand, is non-moving. It is inflated and remains static unless the user moves. For example, the client must remember to do forward leans, tilt in space, or vertical push-ups. A static cushion will never generate any movement on its own, ever. You can see that there is absolutely no significant change in the pressure mapping image and there will not be if the user does not move. This means the static cushion cannot initiate a change to the constant pressure applied to the skin and tissue by itself. The static air flotation cushion cannot and will not ever generate movement that will promote circulation on its own. This is a real concern for people with spinal cord injuries that cannot reposition themselves or do the suggested techniques to relieve constant pressure. Pressure ulcers occur in up to 80% of individuals with spinal cord injuries and the number one cause of pressure ulcers is constant unrelieved pressure. Therefore, movement promoting circulation is absolutely critical in preventing pressure ulcers. The choice is yours. You can choose the Softec Automatic Cushion, which provides automatic alternating movement that stimulates circulation. A cushion that offers unlimited customization to provide full-time offloading underneath a current ulcer. Or a motionless air flotation cushion that requires you to lift yourself up frequently as the only means of promoting circulation and preventing pressure ulcers. Visit our website and read our clinical validations page, which shows clinical studies and case reports written by medical professionals. If you have further questions, ask your physician about the benefits of alternating therapy in the prevention and treatment of pressure ulcers. Call us today for more information at 1-866-782-9655. Thank you.